Hello, in this tutorial we will learn how to share Android Studio project to GitHub. In order to do that, we will need one desktop application which is known as Git. To download it, go to your browser and search for Git download. Click on this first link and download the Git as per your operating system. After download complete, open setup for installation and complete the installation process. And done, the Git is now installed in our system. Now let's open the GitHub and sign into your GitHub account. Here you can see I have no repository or project created in my account. Now let's move to the Android Studio part. Go to File menu and select Settings. Now go to Version Control and select Git. Here we need to set path of the git executable file which we had installed previously and it is basically inside your system drive. Now click on this folder icon, select your system drive, program files and select git. Go to bin and select git.exe. Click OK. The path to git executable is now set. To check whether it is valid or not, click on this test button. And you will see a dialog of git version with title git executed successfully. Click OK. Now let's set up github account in android studio. Again go to file menu and settings. And here inside version control select github. Click on add account. Alternatively you can use the plus icon on the right side if you have already added github account and you need to add one more. Now enter your email and password which you are using for sign in on github website. and click login here you can see the github account is added to android studio click ok we also need to set email and username using git command line to do that open start menu and search for git cmd and open git cmd Now run this command git config dash dash global user dot email and type your github email address. Hit enter to run this command. Now let's run another command git config dash dash global user dot name and type your name. Hit enter and we are good to go. Close this window. 
So from start to here is one time setup process and you don't need to follow every time. In order to share Android Studio project onto the GitHub, we first need to enable version control integration. Now remember the upcoming steps because you have to follow these steps every time you share the project on GitHub. To enable version control integration, go to VCS and click on enable version control integration. Now select git from here and click on ok. And you can see the git repository is now created for current project. And also the title of files are turned in red color. That is because we have a repository for the current project. But the project files are not added to that repository yet. Now go to VCS, select import into version control and click on share project on GitHub. In this dialog, you can set the repository name, access type, descriptions, etc. Let's set repository name to my application test. With this checkbox, you can set the access type like private and public. If you set private, then this repository will not be accessible for anyone except the ones who you have given permission or access. Or if you set public, then everyone can see your repository on GitHub. So let's keep it public and add some description. Now click on share button. Here is the list of files that can be added to your repository. The best part is it only selects the essential files and not unnecessary files. You can also write your commit message here. Let's keep it as initial commit and click on add button. Here you can see the status message pushing to github master. And we have the final message successfully shared project on github. Also you can see title of files is now turned in original color because everything is now committed and pushed to the repository. Now let's go back to the github.com and refresh the page to see whether the project is shared with github or not. You can see our android studio project with name my application test. Here is the commit message and this is how you can share your android studio project to the github. Now let's make some changes in our project and update it on github. Just for testing purpose, I am adding a toast in main activity file. Here you can see the title of main activity file is turned in some type of blue color which means the file is already available in repository but has some uncommitted changes. You can also see this type of light green color in files which has something new added. Now let's commit the new changes in repository. In order to do that go to VCS and click on commit or alternatively you can use ctrl plus k shortcut. Here you can type your latest commit message. With the help of this side by side windows you can compare your new code with the previous one or check what are the changes in the new code. Now click the commit button and the android studio will commit the changes. Here you can see one file committed and the commit message. And finally to push this newly committed changes to the github, go to vcs, select git and click on push. Alternatively, you can use Ctrl plus Shift plus K shortcut. In this push dialog, you will see a list of all commits. Select the parent master item and click on push button. We got a message pushed one commit to origin master. Also you can see the title of files are now turned in normal color. Now let's verify new code on github. Refresh the current page and let's check our main activity. Here you can see the latest commit message. And done, our main activity file has this toast. If you want to see all changes in committed files, you can click on this commit message.
So this is for today's video. I hope you like this video. See you in the next Android tutorial and thank you very much for watching.